The content on this channel has been created for adults. If you're not at least 13 years of age or older, then please do not watch this content. Sorry, dude. Come back when you're 13. What's up family? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Off Tap Life. Always a pleasure to be rocking and rolling for all you beautiful people around the globe. Guys, we got another one. Yo, Tana hooked you guys up. Tana hooked you guys up in particular Steve. She even had this shout out earlier. I forgot to read on the last journey one that she did, but she said, hey, no pants, La France. Here you go. Let's rock this. Enjoy. And uh, so she already showed Steve some love. Everyone knows how much Steve loves freaking Journey. It's always going on about Journey. So she gave her the hookup. And she also wrote a shout out for this one here. She wrote, dedicated to you, Faith. The name of the song says it all. Enjoy. It's Journey, faithfully, courtesy of Tana. Thank you very much. Now, we've done this about three months ago. We did this song here. And uh, so I did a little snoopy doopy doopy to see if we could find a different version other than the official video, which we did before. And I found this one here live in Manila. Live in Manila, man. Journey performing this live in Manila. I think this is going to be a real treat. So without further ado, for me, for Tana, for Steve, for all of you, let's get it. <sighs> I'm gonna say it, give me that piano action each and every time I'm hooked. You got me. When this starts playing, dude, oh my gosh, dude, this this is a banger. That is freaking that's this is this is dope. It catches you, it grabs you right early on, man. I always love it when the audience knows the song and they're like ready, you know, to drop the freaking lyrics themselves into it and sing it. That is so cool, man. And this song is epic. Like, I don't know, this is, seems to be like one of those songs that would have been one of their like flagship songs. When you hear it, you go, ooh, I don't know. Because I remember it from hearing it that last time we did the reaction to it. And like, even me, like, I heard the piano start playing again. Ooh, ooh. I was like, woo cha, woo cha. Woo-cha! <laughs>
I'm confused. I'm confused. I'm a little bit confused. I mean, look, I... I feel like, okay, maybe it's just me, I don't know, but... Does he look different to you? Is that... Is that the same guy who's always been singing the lead here in the group? Is this a different guy? I mean, it looks kind of like a different person. I mean, same long hair kind of vibe, but looks different. And then this guy here. So is, is the Journey dude, is that dude Filipino? Or not? Or not? Nah? Am, I, am I tripping out here? Oh my gosh, I feel like I need some context here. But it says Journey. This is from the Journey's actual official thing. I mean, it can't be an impersonator. I mean, I guess that's him. I mean, I, I mean, I don't really know Journey that well. I mean, Steve made Journey. Amel Arnell, Armel saved Journey. So is that a different singer? This man spreads hope and faith by just being the wonderful soul that he is. He's every bit as good vocally as Steve Perry. His passion, hardworking creed is inspiring and deserves acknowledgement and appreciations. So very grateful that he was found and given the platform to show the world. Okay, so I'm not tripping out then. This is a different guy. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm so confused. I was so like, I was really kind of just, just, just a little bit confused there. Um... Oh, m more information here. Uh, yes, Steve was great, but this guy's great as well, and his story to stardom is even greater. Found on YouTube. Oh, really? And when he was discovered, he didn't even know how good he was, and his English wasn't the best. Give Armel credit. Or is that Arnell? Is that my eyes playing tricks on me? Um... He has put in the hard work. He is good enough that it keeps Journey alive. And to be honest, just entertaining. Don't knock him because he isn't Steve. Acknowledge him for the talent that he was. And where he came from. And what it took to get where he is now. Wow, guys. So there's a story here. Jeez. Okay. Um, I guess the... Oh, he is. Proud Filipino half-blood. And actually, he was the perfect placement for Steve. And he had the best... Um, fit voice for Journey. So is this kind of like a a queen situation where Journey, you know, wanted to keep going or decided to keep going for some reason? I don't know. So did the Steve, did he die or something? Or did he just decide to stop singing? Let me know in the comments. I'm sure you guys will let me know. Um, and uh, they're like now continuing going and performing thanks to the new lead. Is that kind of what's going on, guys? Let me know. This has got me I know I was I was looking at this guy. I'm like, is that the same guy? I don't know. And he felt this guy. So I felt like he felt shorter too. But I was like, I mean, I guess when people get older, I mean, I guess they can get a little shorter. I, I didn't know, man. <laughs> oh my gosh! All right, let's keep going. <laughs> Dude on the guitar is this freaking dope, man. He's freaking just killing it, man. Oh my god. Wow. 
Wow, bro, that's incredible. What? What? What did we just experience, dude? That was awesome. Amel can sing, dude. That dude can sing, man. Freaking, he could sing, dude. This is okay. So I learned something in this. This is crazy. That I totally freaking. Now I get it. I, I'm sure I've seen some comments. You guys were saying something, you know, about this. I totally didn't get it at the time, but I get it. I understand it now. It's very clear to me what's going on here. Uh, I was, I was like, am I tripping? Like I just couldn't. I'm like, okay. And I think the long hair was throwing me even more because I'm like. Okay, maybe you just, you know, you got older and you changed a bit. Like, I did not know what was going on, dude. That was freaking amazing performance. This guy could sing. This guy could sing, you know what I'm saying? So they definitely found a good, um, you know, person to um, take the helm of the vocals. Uh, you know, I think he's done a good job taking the vocals from Steve. Uh, uh, I also say, man, like as a band, Journey sounds great. They sound great. The, the instruments are all freaking just on point, man. They all are freaking seasoned professionals. They know what they're doing. So this is amazing. I really enjoyed this. I really have a great appreciation for this. Um, it's just awesome. Um, and uh, I like stories like that. I like those stories, you know, where, you know, someone's discovered in the most unlikely of places at the most unlikeliest of times to live out a dream that was one of their biggest dreams that unlikely they probably never thought was even possible. And this guy here ending up being able to head, you know, another iconic group, like Journey is a very iconic group, um, to be able to be plucked off of YouTube and given that opportunity, wow. That once again shows the power of YouTube, guys. Shows the power of YouTube, another freaking artist that's been discovered another talent given an opportunity to shine bright in these streets here that's what i'm talking about oh my gosh bravo bravo thank you tana for the request that's been really good because you freaking boot through this whole process right now i was edumacated somehow and you guys probably mentioned this somewhere multiple times and i probably just didn't get it at the point i was like yeah didn't really catch on and put two to two together, but now I get it. So that's dope, freaking awesome, super cool. Makes me love Journey even that much more now. And guys, as always, remember to tune to the fullest. Keep it off tap. We're out. <laughs>